Hey there everyone, welcome to Technisha. In this video, I'm going to show you how to split a first name, middle name and last name using text before and text after functions. Let's get to it. Here is a list of names. You may notice that some of them have first names and last name and some of them have first name, middle name and last name. Let's say we wanted to split the first name, middle name and last name. In the past, we would have to use left, right and some complex functions involving len to figure out the first name, middle name and last name. But with these new Excel functions, you can do it very easily. Let's try to get the first name of all these names using the text before function. The logic we are going to use is to find the text before the first space in all these names. So let's go to cell C4 and type in the formula equal to text before open the parenthesis and the text which is going to be our cell b4 the delimiter which in this case is going to be a space so we need to enter a space in double quotes and then the other options are instance number match mode match end and if not from we don't need any of those so we can just close the brackets now and press enter and then if you copy this formula down, you can get the first name of all these names. Now let's try to get the last name. The logic to get the last name is to find the text after the last instance of space. So in this case, there's only one space, but in our second case, since it has a middle name, we need to find the text after the second space. So to do that, let's type the formula in cell E4. We are going to type in equal to, text after again our text is going to be our cell b4 the delimiter is going to be the space and right now let's say that we put the instance number if we put instance number as one and let me just close it i get the correct last name since it's only a first name and last name but if i drag this formula down in all the names which has a middle name and last name we don't get the correct answer so let me just delete these and let's re-enter the formula. So our first two arguments are correct. And now in the instance number, we can use a trick where we want to look at the space going from the right side of the name, not from the left side. To do that, we can put the instance number as minus one and then close the brackets and that. If I drag the formula down, now we get the correct last name because the minus one instance ensures that it is looking for the space from the right side of the name. Great, we've now got the first name and last name. And all we need to do is to get the middle name for all the names which have that. The logic behind getting the middle name is to get the name between two instances of the space. So let's first get the name before the second instance of the space. So let's go to cell D4 and type in the formula equal to text before our text is going to be the full name. The delimiter is going to be the space. And now we can put the instance number two. And let's just close the brackets and see what we get. Let me just copy the formula down. So we get errors in all the cases where there is no middle name because the second instance of the space is not present in these names. And in the names which have the middle name, we get the result as we want. So let's first take care of the error. Let's go to cell D4 and let's edit our formula. So we've given the text, the delimiter and the instance number. And now in the match mode, we don't need to enter anything because it's not a case sensitive match. And even in this case, we can just leave it empty. And now we can put in a text in case we don't find the second instance. So let's just put it a blank and just press enter and now copy the formula down. There, we've got output only on names where the middle name is present. So now the formula we need to update in such a way that we need to now find in the output the text after the first instance of the space. So let's go to the cell D4 and now let's edit that formula. So let's go to the beginning and now to this output we want to do a text after our text is going to be from the formula text before and then 
the delimiter is going to be the space and then we need to look at the first instance so we can just keep it empty the match mode the match end and now in the case that if you don't find anything we need to again output a black and let's just close this and i'm just going to copy the formula down and that we've now been able to get the middle name only on the names which have the middle name present so we are able to split the first name the middle name and last name using the text before and text after functions these new excel text functions make it easier to get part of a text i hope that this tutorial was of use to you if you liked it please subscribe to my channel till next time ciao